If you're not familiar with um, water levels at all, I'm using one with my slab now. Um, water is basically the only thing that will find its own level, which is why you've got a little bubble in your spirit level. But a water level is basically a long clear tube with water in it and you put some colouring in it to, so it's easier to see and you can use it around corners or across long distances to check the level of things. So I'll show you how I've got this one going. So you can see that at this end I've got the plastic tube and I've got it just staked up and there's where the water level is in this at the moment. So you basically just get it so that you got it against one side of your slab and you can just run along the ground however you want. So it goes all over the joint as long as it's lower than your initial point. And then at this end you basically grab your tube and you raise it up and down to check your level. So if I hold my water level here I keep all my tube up above what I've got and the more tube you let down the lower the water level you will go because you've got more tube for the water to basically fill up. All right. So if you raise up your tube and slowly because you've got to let the water level settle now you should be able to just see that slowly moving up and down like if I do it suddenly you'll see that it bounces up and down a bit until it finds its level alright so I'm going to lower it down and I'm watching the opposite side of my slab as well and now when I get that down so that my water level is right here at the edge of my slab and I hold that still get that bit out of the way this point here and the other end of the hose are exactly the same level in the water tube so you can see that I'm just touching the top of my formwork here and over there is the opposite side of my slab or my formwork and you should just be able to make out where the tube's coming up and you can see that the red liquid is just at the top of my formwork as well. So that means that that corner and the corner I'm sitting at are at the exact same height. So the top of my formwork is level across the corners. Now you usually do this and check it on all four corners and you can check other points if you're concerned that the top of your slab is level or not. Like I've got a spirit level there that'll just check that that section of formwork is level but it's hard to use that to check that my whole formwork is level until I get around to here but by using the water level I can check I can confirm I should say that that side of the slab and this side of the slab are at the same height incredibly simple tool I made this one a few years ago to use with my construction students to show them how to use a water level in our leveling unit and we would check levels around the corner of buildings where you can't see each other and one person would be checking against one height and the other one would be checking against another height and you're just basically checking levels and they're perfect for slabs perfect for setting out um, house spaces, shed spaces, garage spaces, whatever, anything where you want to check the level across a long distance and it's so cheap, just go buy a piece of polytube, fill it with water and put some food dye in it as well that'll help it stand out, it makes it so much easier to see across a long distance. And I got a couple of little rubber bungs 
to put into the ends of the tube so that I can roll up the tube and store it um, without fear of losing my liquid. Give one a go. One thing <coughs> I think I forgot to say is you need to make sure that in the section that you've got your liquid that you have no air bubbles in it. So you spend a bit of time just making sure you get any air bubbles out and there at the end of the tubes first. And um, that way the water will find its own level. Now if I just show you this, here's an example, because I put my rubber bungs back in and they're obviously not at the right level now, but if I remove those, the water finds its level within the tube. So, just a couple of little rubber bungs like that. I got these from the science faculty at my school. And that way I'm able to keep this and I've had this for years to use with my students every year. It's perfect.